SRI Robotics is really about uh, conveying the mission of SRI through robotics technology. It speaks about what SRI does and, and some of the exciting work going on. And we've really come to this place over the last uh, couple of years where um, in the work that we're doing, we've created these platforms and um, this technology that people are really excited about. Think of ants controlled by a computer. Uh -huh. What we have here is uh, small magnets controlled by a magnetic field. I think of it as surfing on the magnetic waves. People are getting a sneak peek now, um, but we're going to be doing things that go to the DARPA challenge, and a lot of these projects are kind of on their way to being ready to demonstrate in a big way there. I really liked the robotic legs that were attached to the calf muscles. This is basically attaching a robot to the body, and so you're not creating a whole other system, you're just aiding the human itself, which I think is pretty cool. To me, it's also a great way for people to just meet real, high-powered engineers doing real things in the world, and, and there's not many opportunities for people to do that in this kind of context. I think this is a wonderful opportunity to sort of reach out to the public, uh, especially for the, the younger people that are here to inspire them to go into these fields, and uh, I think it's really nice to open our doors and, uh, you know, share what we're doing. So anyway, I'm going to apply a voltage to this pad, so I'm going to pick it up, and I'm going to grip a bunch of pennies. And if I turn the voltage off, the pennies fall right off. So now, you have the electrostatic pad on the back of your iPad case, and you just turn it on, and you place it onto the wall. And then it sticks onto the wall. And then you can go about whatever you wanted to do, and now you don't even have to hold it anymore. Imagine a wounded warrior kind of being delivered into the back of a truck, and you would have all of the equipment in the back of the truck able to operate. And the surgeon could be tens, hundreds, or thousands of miles away. Our group is a hybrid of scientists and engineers who are all looking at component technologies around robotics and how to apply them in new ways. So we've got this you know, great pipeline going at every level, the invention stage, the initial platform stage with government customers, commercial clients who are helping to see the market, and then we have multiple spin-outs that are happening in, um, as well. Robotics is an incredibly interdisciplinary effort involving lots of fields and it's right at the bleeding edge of the state of the art. So you get these incredible minds together and you can reach across this broad field and you can do amazing things. Yeah, the robot revolution, it's coming.